Okay, so welcome to our short explanation of how to remove uh, add-ins that are seemingly stuck in Outlook. Yeah, you can see this Inky um, add-in. By the way, Inky is a fantastic service and I highly recommend you use it. But it works at the back end. You don't need, well, I don't need the client. So, uh, what I would uh, normally do is you'd go to File and Options and then into your Add-in Manager, which is right there. And you'd look through here. You'd go to your Com add-ins, Disabled add-ins. Trust me, Inky isn't here. I'm not going to waste your time. So then how the heck do you get rid of this and anything else that you're stuck with that you can't get rid of? Well, it turns out you do it through your Outlook Web Access. And now I'm using Office 365, so that's how this has uh, come about. So what you want to do is launch a browser. Let's bring up a new window here and go to uh, mail.office365.com. That'll sign you into your mail. And uh, in the top right-hand corner, immediately go to the cog for settings and go to options. And apparently get old waiting. Normally this just seems to take a few seconds. Okay, so it's under general, which was nice of it not to expand. And then manage add-ins, and that's, there you go. Now I do want to show you something that uh, is quite confusing. Um, so if I go back to uh, my mail here, you can see um, that uh, if I uh, click the cog here, uh, instead of getting options, for some reason, it's taking me uh, just into these settings, which is super weird. And you'll notice there's manage add-ins, manage connectors, and you think, oh, I just have a new version, that's where it is. Nope, if you go into here, you'll see that, to make a long story short, there's no add-ins, at least in my case, um, and there's nothing in connectors either. So that's super weird. So there we go, if you uh, click the cog and you see this, what you need to do is go into your app settings. Uh, even if you do a search here, it doesn't seem to find it. So just to go into your mail settings, expand general, and go into mobile add or manage add-ins. I'm going to remove both Skeptify and uh, Fish Pro, and I'm going to remove Inky too. So I can just disable them by clicking the checkbox, but I actually want to get rid of them. So uh, I'm going to click on this, and I'm going to click uninstall. Boom. And then I'm going to click on this one, Fish Pro. Uh, I'm going to uninstall. And Skeptify. By the way, I tested uh, these different products, and Inky is a great product. I suggest you take a look at it if you're uh, in a corporate setting. So let's just take a look. So Inky's there now. Let's close Outlook. Let it sit for a minute. Finish closing. We'll launch Outlook again. Boom! It's gone. So that's all you do. If you have any questions, please get a hold of us at www.uartech.ca. Thank you. Bye-bye.